Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm going to be unboxing my January Owl Crate box. So I'm very, very excited to see what Owl Crate does this year. So let's go ahead and get started uh, with this box. So, yay. Um, so far, it looks good. So we have a spoiler card on top here. And this one's theme was Katane de Fay. Um, so that's very, very nice. Um, so the first thing I'm seeing here is this right here. Um, so this seems to be a tape measure designed by Nerdy Ink, inspired by an enchantment of ravens. So that's really cool. So it's just a measuring tape, which is pretty useful. And then you just click on the actual thing. It says up, so I like that. Um, so it has a raven on one side, and then on the other side, it has a quote that says, Everyone in the forest waited with an indrawn breath, waiting for the taste of autumn. So, yeah, that's a very cool item, and it looks good, so I'm pretty happy with that. So the next thing we have is our enamel pen. So last... <clears throat> Sorry, I'm currently sick right now, so sorry about that. But we have our monthly pin for this year. Um, last year they did a they did the luggage pins, but this year they're doing treasure tomes, and these are very cool. They um showed a sneak peek of it. Well, they revealed it on their Instagram page um, earlier this month. But this one is inspired by. So Coral Prince, one of 12, so we'll be getting one each month. Uh, but these are so, so cool. These are enamel pens that are books, but they open up. So yeah, these enamel pens open up and I think it's so cool. And I love the design of this one. Um, so the concept was made by Paper Bones, and this was designed by no one no one designs so that's really cool and like i said this is um inspired by the cruel prince by holly black um so i think that's really really nice um and i really like these so um i can't wait to get these in my boxes they're so cool so i'm very happy with that so the next thing we have is this box right here and let me just say the box that they did is so so pretty i really love the design of the box alone um it is a travel mug uh, which is a inspired by fortune swan series by kj sutton and the artwork was created by i mean Mac illustrations. Um, probably pronounced that really wrong, but let's go ahead and open this box up. So it is just a travel mug, but I'm very excited for it. And I'm having a hard time opening it up. Okay, there we go. Um, we have the mug here, and it's really, really pretty. I really love to design that they went with uh so let's go ahead and take off this green thingy so i can read show off the full design um it has a quote on it that says fear is the seed my love it can grow from pain or anger or it grows from something else hope love um, I really like that quote, but I overall just love the design that they did. Um, so yeah, I really love this item. This is really, really useful, um, and it looks pretty as well. So I'm very happy with this. Um, okay, so I think we only have two more items left. So the next one is seems to be a tote bag. Now, I already have a lot of tote bags, but this one seems to be pretty, probably the best tote bag that I received from a subscription box. So we have a, inside the tote bag, we have a pocket in here. I'm trying to show you guys, yeah, 
So we have a pocket in here that I love and it's a pretty deep pocket. And then you can actually um, zip this tote bag up, which is so nice and so cool that you can zip this tote bag up. So the quality is there. And then you have two different um, like um, ways to hold it. So you have like the regular tote bag and then we have like a longer strap that you could, uh, you could uh, adjust. So I really, really love that as well. Um, and of course we have the nice design on the actual front of the tote bag there. Um, and it says finest selection in the fairy realm. Dark tan and green player booksellers. Um, it's a nice design. I have no idea what this is from, but let's go ahead and find out. So, this is a. This is inspired by the Crow Prince uh, by Holly Black, and it was designed by Paperback Bones. So, that's really cool. And it seems like we have multiple items inspired by. The crow prints but that's really really nice i do want to get around to reading the crow prints eventually so i hope i get around to that pretty soon but let's go on and move on to the next item so we have another box here which again is a really nice design box and it seems to be a display board uh which is inspired by court of thrones roses by Terry J. Mass. And it was designed by wolfandbear.co, so that's really cool. We have a few things in here. So the first is we have like a, we have a block here with a nice design on it. Uh, with some mushrooms and flowers, that's really cool. And it connects to a USB. And then we have two um, boards on here. So we have one that has a design on it already. Um, which you have to take out the film to make it like clear, which I will do in a minute. I will insert a clip so you guys can see it glow up because you place it in here to the to the block wood, connect it, and it lights up, which is really nice. Um, and it says, um, death incarnated night trampin. I'm sorry for pronouncing things wrong, but that's a really nice design. But you also get a blank one, which is also going to be clear when you take off the film for it. Um, but it comes with a marker, which it fell on the ground. But it came with a marker where you could write anything on here and you could just switch it out and you could have that glow up. So I think that's pretty cool. So I really do like this item and it looks pretty nice. So that's another pretty great item. So I love every single item that we received this month so i'm pretty happy with that and now we just have the actual book here um so before we get to the book we have um next month's theme which is magic and mischief mischief um so that's the theme for february and on the back we have a sneak peek which seems to be a blanket that we will be getting in February box which I'm very excited for. I love receiving blankets and these boxes so I'm very excited for that and it will be designed by Florences and Flowers so that's really, really cool. I'm very excited for that and then we have our like newsletter thing pamphlet that they do so inside here you will find the interview with the author and then you will see the original cover and what they to the their edition and then we have a behind the scenes which um show you the end pages and stuff um we have some recommendations if you end up enjoying this one's book um and then we have a interview with the vendor so one of the people that design these items um they have their monthly photo challenge here and they have their Spotify monthly playlist that they do every single month and some exciting book releases for the month of January. So that's really cool. Anyways, now we have the actual book here, which is The Berry and the Bound by Rachel Hassan. So it is shrink wrap. So let's go ahead 
and open this up and i will say so far i love what they've done to this they redesigned the cover completely and i love it so much more than the original one this is so beautiful i love it um on the back it says come back to the forest and it's just it's so beautiful and i love what they did to it um so let's go ahead and take off the dust jacket it does have some reversible artwork on the dust jacket and it's really, really nice the artwork is amazing so i like that and then on the naked hardback we have this beautiful gold falling i the only thing i wish that they did if they centered it more because it's really leaning a lot to the left side of it but it still looks really really beautiful and it says you were all the magic i ever needed so that's really nice and on the back it says this book is the property of the bridget bishop memorial library please return and then it just have an address so that looks so 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 good i love the gold falling this is such a beautiful edition. Um, and then we have some beautiful in pages on the front. I love them. The artwork is stunning. And we have some different in pages on the back, which I love. And I hope um, our crate keep doing these type of in pages. Because normally our crate, they would just do like a pattern for the in pages. But these are so, so, so pretty. I love them. And then... We have a bound in author letter, so that's really cool, and it's also signed by the author, so I'm very happy with that. I love that they um, decided to bound in the author letter, and I hope they keep doing that for their future books, um, and I love that it's also signed. So, yeah, that's everything in this month's book, and I love what they did to the book. Um, I'm just waiting for one day for our crate to have all of their books be spray edged or stencil edges or digital spray edges. Um, I really want them to do that, but I think you see there's no special edges or anything. But I hope one day they end up doing that for all of their books. They do it sometimes, but it's very rare that they do it. But I really love what they did with this book regardless. Um, and then we do have a art print here that says, um, you understand power, all living things do, all things, all dead things too. <laughs> and then on the back, we have some bonus content, um, with a QR code. So that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, that's everything that we received in this month's book. I love all of the items. And I love that all of the items match the book as well. Um, they're all green and, like, brownish. So, like, nature theme. So, they all fit this cottage core theme that they have going on. Um, I love the book. I love the items. So, I'm very happy with um, our crate and what they done for this month. And this is the only subscription box that I received on time because it's January and this is a January box and I haven't received my lemon crate or my fairy loot or my tooth retreat. Um, I did receive my afterlight though this month on time, January. Um, but that's the only thing. So, um, but regardless, I'm very happy with everything. Um, and yeah, I can't wait to see what our crate does in their favorite box. I'm very excited for that because it does have the blanket. So yeah. Anyways, let me know what you guys think of the book and the items. Um, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.